Hi, welcome to Learn Arabic Online, Arabic with Noel. In this course, you will learn the short vowels. In this course, you will learn to pronounce the sounds of Arabic letters and read it. To pronounce the letters Arabic, you need to know two vowels, short vowels and tall vowels. The role of the two vowels is to sign like the vowels in European language, make the sound. But the difference, the short vowels in Arabic not the same like the letter vowels as in European language. What means the short voyage? The short voyage we call it in Arabic harakas. Harakas, movements that make the letter move from the consonant letter to a sound letter. In the Arabic language, there are three short voyages Fetha, Fetha, Dhamma, Dhamma, and Kassara, Kassara, a marketing writing above or below the consonants. The first voyage, Fetha, Fetha, a short diagonal stroke, writing below in Arabic letter. The second voyage, Damma, Damma. This voyage is shaped like a small version of the Arabic letter well. And it's writing above an Arabic letter. The third short vowel, kasra, kasra, a short diagonal stroke writing below an Arabic letter. And now. You might have noticed that Fatha and Kasra are similar. So what is the difference between these two short voyels? Let's see. When we put this struck above the letter, we call it Fatha. And when we put it under the letter, we call it Kasra. Now, let's see the pronunciation of letters with Fatha. The, the letter Ba. Ba. Now, let's see the pronunciation of letters with Kasra. B. B. The difference now is clear, so let's try it with other letter with the short voice Fetha. Ba, Ba, Ta, Ta, Da, Da, Ra. Ra, ka, ka, la, la, ma, ma, na, na. Now let's try it with the short voyel kasra. B, B, T, T, D, D, R, R, K, K, 
Ki Li Li Mi Mi Ni Ni And now let's see the pronunciation of letters with Dhamma and as we say Dhamma is like a small version of the Arabic letter Wow and it's written above an Arabic letter Let's try it Now let's try it with the short voyels Dhamma Bo, bo, chu, chu, de, de, ro, ro, ko, ko, lo, lo, mo. Mo. No, no. And now, with a little of exercise and practice, you will be able to pronounce and read all the letters Arabic. So, see you in the next course. Ila Goodbye.